You are awake. Did you sleep well? This astonishes you, after all you experienced. I suppose I should have seen this coming. Introduction to the supernatural world can often have unpredictable effects on the mundane mind. It may take some time for you to process it all. I believe you might be right, especially if last night is any indication. I think you are going to make this transition just fine. And this is good, because there is so little time to waste. My father Kalash is waiting to speak to you in the room beyond the red drapes. When you are ready, seek him out. In the meantime, relax and explore the facility. I will be here if you have any questions. Yes? Certainly. What is your question? We are peacekeepers. We protect the mundane world from the threats of the supernatural. We help who we can, destroy ones we must, and recruit those who are willing. With you, I suppose we did all three. As a whole, for thousands of years. But the New York branch is only 400 years old. As long as there is need of us, we will be here. We do not exactly advertise our presence. We prefer it that way. But the truth is, the last century has seen a diminishing need for our services. Things have certainly changed. Yes, supernatural threats have been escalating. It happened so suddenly we were caught unprepared. We had become complacent. We have not been recruiting. You are the first new recruit in decades. The first of many, we hope. I will do my best to answer. Me? What do you want to know? The term is Jin. And yes, on my father's side. And no, I do not grant wishes. When was this city founded? 1624. Yes, I was just a child, but it was around that time. 418. No, 19. My birthday was last month. It is difficult to keep track, but Father always remembers. I will do my best to answer. Eli is my partner and a dear, dear friend. We have saved each other's lives more often than we can count. You and he have much in common. He was once mundane, like yourself. I would recommend asking him about his transition. It might help with your own. Last night, yes, you gave us quite the chase. We know nothing about the demon that was inside you, but it was a wily thing. As we all are, believe me. It was taunting us, dancing just out of our reach, slaughtering whomever it could. But we got it in the end. Regardless of what happens next, we stopped it. We can all take comfort in that. I do not know. I am not being facetious. I honestly do not know. This building has housed many agents over the centuries, and they too have been given gifts. Photographs and portraits of loved ones, precious possessions long since lost. We do not question it. We merely accept it and be thankful for it. Thank you.
Don't surprise a fire mage like that. <laughs> Bad idea. Anyway, hi. You settling in okay? You noticed? Yeah, I like to do this in my spare time. Keeps me sharp. But seriously, it took me a while to get used to this stuff. It's not gonna happen for you overnight. But you'll get there. Faster than you think. Anyway, I'm sure you want to walk around. I'll be here if you have any questions. I don't see why not. I guess if we're gonna work together, we should know each other. Ask away. Since the Nixon administration, I'm, uh, older than I look. If you must know, I'm 92. It's the magic. Keeps me young. No surgery required. Yeah, it... it is what it is, okay? I'm a mage. We live long lives. And a story. Why do you think? Fire mage here. I could easily burn this place to the ground if I'm not careful. I needed a place to practice, and a room insulated with stone was the obvious choice. Besides, I don't feel the cold, so it's quite cozy down here. Ooh, never use the word wizard. It's a social faux pas or something. I'm a mage, with a capital M. The capital is also important. At least that's what the books tell me. I never actually met another mage to find out. Nope, kind of tingles, but that's it. It's kind of like playing with light, at least when it touches my flesh. Clothes, though? I can burn them clear off and I won't even notice. Took about a decade and a dozen indecent exposure arrests before I managed to make my clothes fireproof. Someone's been telling tales out of school, huh? I used to have a pretty normal life. Then one day I set my office on fire. With my mind. Then stuff happened and Mondana found me. She brought me here. The rest is, well, history. Yep. I see why you made a good bartender. People just want to tell you their life stories, huh? I bared my soul enough for one day. Barely even know you. Let's talk about something else. Sure. You too, huh? Wasn't long after I joined up that my first photo appeared. Scared the hell out of me. It's something to do with this building. It wants you to remember who you are, who you were. Don't think about it too hard. I've been here 50 years and I still don't know how it works. Right, see you around. the new one, aren't you? Yes, free will. It can be more trouble than it's worth. As for me, I am Kalash. I am a jinn of the Ancient Kingdom, and I run this branch of the Unavowed. And you? You were possessed. How'd you let that happen? Sloppy. Sloppy. Such a thing would have been unthinkable once. In my day, even a newborn babe had wits enough to leave books of demonic evil alone. Mundanes today don't know they're born. The world has gotten soft. Needs toughening up. 
How tough are you, new boy? Yes, while its back was turned, a child would be victorious in those circumstances. No, no. You have yet to experience your true crucible, but it will come. Oh yes, it will come. At any rate, we have much to discuss and much to do. Settle in, talk to the others, get the lay of the land. I will call our meeting when you are ready. Hmm? What is it? You ready to start the meeting? Indeed, the time for waiting is past. Father, you met our latest recruit? Yes. I admit he doesn't look like much, but we'll see what this life makes of him. We were all neophytes once, Kalash. Most of us, Mage Beckett. Most of us. I have read the reports on your last mission. Mage Beckett, is it true you summoned a void creature? Yes, by accident, I swear. Irrelevant. Magic is unpredictable. I understand this. What I don't understand is why you killed the thing. A sentient being whose only crime was being summoned by you. I was going to eat people. We had no choice. That choice has consequences. Word will get back to its people. There will be a reckoning of some kind. I hope the two of you are prepared to deal with it when it comes. That may be, but you had no authority over them. It was their choice to make. Father, regardless of our choices, the Void Creature is gone. We have a more pressing concern. Yes, you let the demon escape. Your mission was a failure. Saving you was a side objective, nothing more. Saving people isn't a side objective, sir. And how many might now die because you let the demon escape? I was so close. I had it contained, but it was stronger than I expected. I see. This is becoming distressingly commonplace. Nevertheless, Eli speaks the truth. We underestimated the threat. Then that will have to be sufficient. And now to the next item at hand. Your next mission. You are correct. In more ways than you can imagine. I have detected void activity in the East Village, somewhere close to Aster Place. You are to travel there, determine the cause of the disturbance, and neutralize it. It means do whatever it takes. Are you sure he's ready to go out into the field so soon? These are dangerous times. Dark forces are coming. We don't have the time for traditional training. If he isn't able to handle it immediately, we might as well kill him now. Trial by fire, sink or swim, do or die. You want to prove yourself to the unavowed new boy? Now is your chance. Meeting adjourned. Well, I guess that settles that. None of us. Yeah, we're a team. Try not to forget that. Anyway, we're ready when you are. Looks like the K-Train is down. Again. Eli, the K-Train was discontinued in 1988. Was it? I could swear I took it to the Museum of Natural History not too long ago. You did, in 1986. Oh. So, I guess we won't be taking the K-Train. No, we will not.
Hmm. Still raining. At least nothing's here waiting to kill us. Well, the night is young. <laughs> 